All right, it's the best time of the week. It's time for Lucky Time Explosion. <laughs> oh, my colon. <laughs> What's wrong with your colon? Well, every morning is a rough morning. With my I know, I know. It's been a rough one. Everyone's having a rough week. Everyone's tired, busy, you know. It's been a lot of a lot of. I'm a black animal. Why are you trying to instigate violence right now? Because I'm black and I like violence. Yeah. I'm an animal. So then- I'm an animal. I'm a black animal. Ah! Let's kill all white people. Yeah, baby. Apparently, that's what we've been seeing. You've had a rough week. I'm sure you must be exhausted. No, right I'm, now. I'm I'm exhausted, but it's like a happy exhaustion. Yeah. It's, it's like an, an excited exhaustion. Yeah, for sure. Because he got it. Yeah, Trump is getting arrested. Well, he got arrested. He didn't get really get like handcuffed. Right. I really like, wanted like the mug shot. There was no mug shot. The mug shot would have been more theatrical. Yeah. The question I have is that uh, the Secret Service now have to go to jail with him. Why? Because if you're a president, ex-president, oh, they, they follow oh. you everywhere for the rest of your life after you're out of I office. I heard something like that. Yeah. So I think they have to have like earpieces in. And, you know, do they turn from his guardians to his jailers? Are they like, POTUS has dropped the soap. POTUS has dropped the soap. Code <laughs> code red. Code red. Congratulations on uh, being on Ben Shapiro. I know. Fuck. <laughs> That's it's amazing. It's a second time. I think I was on it before for the abortion performance I did in front of the church. Mm. Remember I was like hitting the babies? Because mm. everyone in the comments knew me from that. Like, I knew I knew her from somewhere. Right. And you know what's interesting? Because the right wing has like an archive of all my shit. They're they archiving? even brought up a, a 2018 performance I did on the streets where I was like rolling on the floor. I was wow. like, wow, they're into it. I want um, the right wing to um to uh to uh sponsor a show. I want them to produce me, <laughs> like Fox News. I want to have like a performance art political show. Well, they they think you're a um. What do they, what do they say? Like that one Soros guy was like, plant. Yeah, they're like you're they, an in, infiltrator. They yeah, called you infiltrator. You're a baby like, killer. Yeah, that's good though. That's good content. Yeah, it is good content. That's good content. So they should like hire me and have uh, produce my show the right. I yeah. think it'll be the most watched show. I think it'll be more watched than Tucker. Probably. I mean, there's a reason they got you on there. They want the ratings too. They, yeah. They see so, your energy. So yeah, that's why I think you you might actually be a genius. That's my theory. See, maybe. So I have a I have an idea. I think we should test you. Okay, test me. Test- uh, we're going to start with some Rorschach tests, some classical okay. psychology here. Those with the messy images. Okay, let me put yeah. on my glasses. So put on the blind. glasses, get ready. You can answer to Morgan what you think these are and uh, start are with the Are you going to tell me one. how fucked up I am after I answer? Yeah, afterwards. We'll I tell saw you. this before. What's that, what does that look like to you? A bat. To me, it looks like a fox with four eyes. Nice. You're both insane. Next. Okay. Oh man, a butt, a cold like a, a pelvis. You know, like the sacrum. Mm, yeah. Looks like a sacrum. That's like a sacrum, but that person has hemorrhoids. And I feel like the butt is opening. Like when I open up my diaper, that's what it would do look like. Do you have a pink sock? Oh God, the pink sock. Not right on, not on me, but I do have pink socks. Oh. I have a pink pussy. <laughs> the pussy is pink, but the, you know the pink sock, right? What's the pink sock? Prolapsed I have- asshole. Oh, it looks like a pink sock. A pink, yeah, I yeah. know prolapsed vagina. So, so both of you guys said uh, that it looked like a butt or a sacrum. The most popular response is a four-legged animal or two humans, maybe an uh, elephant or a bear. That. No, that's which, stupid. That means Who's you guys that, are white obsessed people? with bop. Butts. I'm white, and that looks like a prolapsed asshole. No, look like a butt. So um, who the fuck is who the fuck said butt? Or was it what, just what, you like, guys? What just serial guys. killer said butt? Damn. You was too. it like Ted Bundy or something? All right, we've got number three here. What does this one oh, remind that's... you guys of? That's... Like alien Martians. Are... It looks like alien Martian head saying, hey, and then it has like two children. And then it has a uterus or something. <laughs> looks like, yeah, like a butterfly. Now that you say now that, you say that yeah, I, I, after hearing that, I, I'm going to have to concur. That's an alien saying, hey, with the two floating puppet-like children. There seems to be some sort of stain in between. The, they maybe lactated blood. Mm, I think it looks like two blood women lactation? gathering water out of a well. That's really sweet. Oh, yeah, that's what I see. I didn't, okay, let's see what's the most popular response is. <laughs> two people. 
That means I am the only normal one here. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, that makes sense. I, me. I am in the suit. Is so. this the normal podcast? This is the normal podcast hour with normal Brandon. So why are you in a suit? Uh, I'm in a suit because I went to the Tribeca Ball last night. Oh. And I didn't have a chance to change. Wait, is it Tribeca Film Festival? No, it's for the New York Academy of Art. It's the graduation for the artists graduating from are you the teaching? New York Academy of Art. No, no, I was just there to attend. Just to, just You're to a go spectator. To the, yeah, I was a spectator, just going to see the art. So you, you know? slept in this shit? No, but I, uh, this is, I slept naked and then put it back on and came to work. You're weird. Yeah, a little bit. I Don't you have different that. energy every day? Sometimes I feel like I can't wear the same thing twice because I have like a different energy. I used to feel like that, but my favorite thing for fashion is just to have like a uniform and just wear the same thing every day. I don't need to express myself through my clothing. I'm weird enough, you know? Oh, excuse me. Uh, that's my, I don't know, that, that's my theory. Actually, it's probably just because I'm lazy and I don't, okay. don't want to have to like pick out a clothes every day and think about what mood I'm in mm -hmm. or let my clothes dictate my mood. Mm -hmm. So if I just have like a uniform. In high school, it was a, a black turtleneck and I had like little goth hair. Are was, you like, like uh, yeah, maybe you have Asperger's like, um, like, for, like um, Zuckerberg. You would make is. so much more money. Wow. Yeah. We would have a bigger studio, more expensive microphones. We'd have a huge crew working around the clock, writing, pampering yeah. us, bathing us. A loofas, bigger supply soaps. of ice for Barney to chew. All right, so next block. We got a few okay. more of these to go through. What's Number four. Block? What does this guy look to you? Um, two like, uh, animals uh kissing mm. and then um like a spider or an ant going in the middle this shit mm. right looks yeah. like, like an ant or something see like i i don't agree with either of you i see a robot with tiny arms and a huge robot penis wow I get that. Yeah. Did you see the robot penis no to me it looks like a um what do you call that a, a pelvis robot penis. A pelvis bone no 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 that's what oh, you call okay. a robot penis Let's okay see. what's the normal people most normal people say animal hide or an animal skin or a skin rug that who are sound they like interviewing normal. i want to know who they're interviewing yeah i was way off definitely white people yes why so white ants yeah <laughs> <laughs> what makes something what get, what tips you off to a white answer because it's dumb with like no we're boring it's like it's flat there's yeah. no like rhythm to it but now you're a white person that is after true. yesterday you've you've transitioned i know I was, I was trying to like um explore my whiteness but no one believed me you know, I was scared when I was um, when it was raining and showering. I was like, "Oh my god, people are gonna know my big secret that I'm really black." Oh right, that's, that was a little streaky. You know, so. I know I wanted this to be more even. The do you know the paint? I, maybe I should buy like a the. You could just rag. say you're an ashy white person. I could say that. Yeah. So. White people do not know what being ashy means. You know, I, they no say idea. you do get ashy, but you can't see it. Unless yeah. you get dry skin. I've, I yeah, mean, they say you do get ashy, yeah, but you can't they, see it. We call it dandruff because you can only see it when it falls on your clothes off your head. Ill, your, your ashiness falls on the clothes? I think that's what, I think it's I the see, same thing. I see, this is why white people are reptilian. Because uh, your skin sheds like a reptile. And, you get head and shoulders for that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. It moisturizes your flaky shit. What, what do you know about reptile people? The Queen of England stealing like diamonds and stealing statues, never getting in trouble, having yeah. the world's money, yeah. being all like the blood. Um, you know, corpse magic or corpse. Uh, like the the 14th century aristocracy in uh, Britain used to do things like bathe in virgin blood. Yes, and yeah, I like that. They shit. would like crush up a skull if they had a headache. They'd find some peasant skull. And, they like, said crush like the Queen up. of England like smears like two year old blood on her. Like she eats like baby blood to stay young yeah, yeah like they, she's always two years old or they something they do say that i don't I like know if it's that. true but they definitely say it well it's funny you're saying about the nordic thing because on along with the lizard people ooh, who's lizard the lizard people, people the lizard people i think is more like an anti-semitic trope it's like they say oh who runs the world because you know it comes so from they're that saying guy that David jews are, are lizards i thought yeah. they, they said that jews are devils well that too. that too they also say that people say a lot of shit is is the moral of the story but uh, it comes from a guy named david ike so david oh, ike, i like him i always yeah. watch him he's yeah. a british dude he's like doo, 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 doo. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. he was a sports announcer first. oh he was that was his first job he's a sports okay, announcer he's see like, that. He has a good voice he was he like a, a popular voice. sports announcer and then as he retired from sports announcing he got into lecturing and taught him writing these books right mm -hmm. and so a, a typical david ike concert 
is like he sells out stadiums too. Yeah, I yeah. know he's a very he's stadiums. a YouTuber. I thought he was a YouTuber. No, he would sell out stadiums of and people music buying his or books. just conspiracy. No, just talking. Yeah, he's really good. Yeah. yeah, and he talks for like literally these things are like six hours long. And what he does is for the first four hours, he just talks about power structures and society and the way you know the history of it mm -hmm. and how it goes. And then it's getting more and more to like that other that's in control. And then at the very end of the thing, he goes, like, after saying things that are pretty much true for, like, four hours, he goes, and now here's where I lose some people, but stay with me. Who are, who's them? Who's they? Lizard people from another dimension, like, who live underground. Oh, the aliens? No. He says they're, like, underground lizard people who had a society and had a civilization and now secretly control ours from, like, the middle of the hollow earth. I know there's an alien conspiracy that there's aliens coming or aliens... Well, that's like, the Nordic thing you're talking about. Because aren't it's like the aliens in Area 51 that they're hiding and then they're going to come out and eat us or something like in a year? Well, I want to be friends with them, actually. What do you, what do you know well, about Area 51? I don't know much about Area 51, but I did see The Hills Have Eyes. Yeah. What is that movie? Well, actually, that's a sick fucking that's movie where funny. everyone is mutated from all the nuclear experiments that is took that what, That's the is movie that or is that real life? So it sounds that's... like real. It sounds like what's happening right now. Yeah. I... I agree with that. So area and they're right here in New York City too. Somehow they spread. You're a mutant, and so am I. Well, we are. <laughs> I'm a Jew, so I'm a lizard person. Uh oh, and a, and a devil. ultra mutant. I'm a devil lizard. Mutant. Uh, mutant. Mutant. And that makes me pretty badass. I mean, there's not too many people that are <laughs> lizard, wizard, mutant. What was the last one? Devil. 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 I'm black animal mutant. Yeah, is that See? you have the you have the good art mutations because you guys both make good art, so you got that going for you. We're kicking ass, man. Yeah. See, they they're just jealous. Yeah, no, the deal with area. What are you? Uh, What's your problem? I'm a Nordic alien. Ew, yeah. you're like a white guy. Yeah, I'm like a white guy. Oh, I'm, no, I'm, your, not I'm your fun. typical. He's uh, one of the good ones. <laughs> that's what they right? say. I'm like Jewish, English? so I, I guess I'm, oh, no, I don't think I'm white. I'm like out. a whole nother. I say I'm Texan. That's oh, where you I was you born. Was your, are you German or something? I think. I actually don't really know, but I think it's Dutch and Swedish mainly. Oh, you're really white. Yeah, we're really white. From, oh, cause wow. Because the, the Dutch and Swedish settled Texas, right? If you go to anywhere in Texas, there's an old Swedish house. It's What's like your a last cabin. name? Uh, it used to be pronounced Wieskruber. Oh, my God. Now it's Wise Carver. And they actually changed it. This is the funniest thing. I'm super white, but they still changed my fucking name at Ellis Island. From Wieskruber to Wise Carver. Wieskruber sounds better. Yeah, I think so. It means hide tanner, the stinkiest job of the Middle Ages when you like slap the skins leather? on rocks. Yeah, leather working. I slap my skin on rocks all the time. Yeah. It looks like it. <laughs> <laughs> That's what they say. Burn. I've heard that before. Burn. Okay, so it's we have okay. a boring white man in the middle. Yeah, exactly. It's okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm, the, I'm the most hated right now, right? I'm like, yeah. the cis, I'm a oh, cisgender. Yeah. Uh, white heteronormative male. neurotypical well. white male yeah that's Oof. the worst thing in a suit too ouch uh, yeah. double negative points yeah there. you look like a racist but i know but i know wait wait a minute i got a space force t-shirt on you still look more racist the yeah, more buttons yeah. go down the more racist there we go <laughs> <laughs> got Space Force. Oh wow! Oh, wow. Yeah, he's official. Yeah, official. He, he w official. I you win. see that they're the first in the, since the original moon landing, which yeah. definitely happened. Definitely happened. They're it going definitely back up happened. there. They're it going happened. back up there. They're sending a new crew the first Can time I go? since. I don't want be, them to I leave. Think, you know, I don't want them to leave me. They may leave me. They may, may, we got instructions to leave your fucking ass here. But then here. you can become the queen of the motherfucking moon. <laughs> that is true. You could just take over. This <laughs> land is yours now. You you could fucking. That's true. Pack, I'm sad. Pack that I need party an audience. Moon colony. Yeah, I think they'll. Yeah, I think they'll tell me like you can't come back. We got like Biden said no. But they're gonna have to leave you with somebody just to so you can procreate. Yeah, and Who I need. Who is it gonna be? I don't. Um, a Jew. Ooh, well, it looks like it's spicy. me and you, crackhead. We got this. I need a Jew with me. Me and you are going to repopulate the it. fucking moon. I, I, gonna... I always need a Jew in my pocket. Uh, I got you. He's me I got warm. you back. See, like now Wizard Skull's going to be really upset. That no, he's I don't want to yeah. step on any shoes. Yeah, yeah, fuck you, shows. Wizard Skull, for not showing up. He's like, I'd rather go to art shows. He was yeah. exhausted the last time. He's yeah. such a punk. Yeah. <laughs> he's such a punk. I, a I love man. him. Yeah, he's he's really funny, but he's so quiet, and you he's need something to like fuck. come out. Yeah, he's really strange. I can see why women get angry with him. He was like, "Oh, I have all these girl problems because they." He feels okay. So you know how women like attention. 
No, really? Oh, really? Oh, no. I didn't know that. And you know how they're like ne- never dramatic about um, <laughs> getting attention? Um, so he was like that when he has a girlfriend or when they like him. And he's like, I have to go to my art studio and I have to paint and I have to do this. Like the way he blew us off. He said he gets into trouble with them because they want attention. So I said, yeah, you can't have a girlfriend if you're always like. That explains why he didn't respond to my personal dm when i said why don't you invite me to art shows and then i sent him a meme of the overly attached girlfriend mm. Mm. i was his art show girlfriend for a minute i was every thursday we would hang out yeah that's why i told him i said wednesdays is for podcasts thursdays for oh art yeah shows. i saw that that's when because everyone's going around to art shows on thursdays because that's when chelsea happens so everyone yeah. thinks that that's when you need to do yours that's yeah. a weird thing as a running art shows it's like do i do it on thursday or do i try to compete with chelsea or do i try to get Oh, yeah, another crowd. Night. Yeah, it's tough. Curating crowds is weird, you know. If you could get any crowd, that, that's great. Yeah, kind of. Not really, though. I mean, I've had crowds that I kind of wish I didn't get. Like what? Like uh, like the, the guys who score Eventbrite specifically to go to gallery shows to drink free wine. And they're mm. like really creepy and they just like hit on girls oh, and they drink free wine. They're all like, they're like, then they talk about like the lizard conspiracy shit, but they're completely serious. Are they old and white? Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah. Old and Sounds white without like my... money. Oh, that's terrible. Yeah. It's a really bad combo. Oh, that's bad. Yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't even go to that. And I like old, wh- creepy white men. <laughs> Damn. Who is your favorite old, creepy white man? Wizard Skull. Interesting. And Suck Lord is another bum that didn't show up. He's like, I need to do something. I have to get paid. Probably art show. I think he wanted to come here, though. Oh, oh he okay. always wants to come. But here. I, I, I also respect does. Wizard Skull for being like, I don't want to. Yeah, he, yeah. <laughs> he, yeah he's super honest. That I don't want to. Skull. I want to go to art show instead. Man. Fair enough. My I don't leave my enough. room. I don't leave my room. Yeah. Which is not good either. That's not good. I, I But I'm here. Hey. Hey, yo. TikTok censored the fuck out of me. All my videos are silent. You could barely find me. Mm. That's fucked up. Yeah, that They've been promoting me because I talk about the CIA on mine. Really? That's yeah. not fair. Yeah. So you just got to know how to game it. You know, you think about it. It's Shut up, white man. Games, you know. How many followers do you have? Uh, 35,000. Oh, 30, that's you have 240,000. I know. On, on TikTok? Yeah. yeah. Well, then you're not that silent, you know? No, oh, yeah, yes, I am. Now I am. But well, before I wasn't. I feel like a lot of people think they're shadow banned and they I just don't realize how ba- the algorithm works or how shitty it can be. Well, if they're they're knocking her audio out, then... Clearly. They're knocking my audio out like several videos. She's been, she's been shadow banned. I think sure. most of that stuff's probably automated, though. Like, if your mm. audio ends up on, like, a news segment, right? And that news segment's covered by an organization that has copyright Stop claims. making excuses for TikTok. Do you work for them? <laughs> I might you as work well. For, work that does say, make wow, sense. You're really, wow, you're really a good TikTok. Um, yeah, they should have had me at the court hearing instead seriously? of what's his face. No, but and the, Instagram demonetized. They're not going to pay you anymore for reels. Because oh, TikTok, no. does, they don't have competition anymore. Suck Lord's chip series. What are we going to do about that? Yeah, they said they don't have to because uh, TikTok is, they're not, they're not competing with TikTok anymore. So fuck it. So that's it. They demonetize. They're going to start demonetizing reels. I don't know if they've done it yet, but they said they're going to start. Uh, not that I was making any money on it anyway. No, they demonetize well, my Well, back shit. to YouTube. Yeah. TikTok's trying to get me to sell um, stuff. They do that to you, the product placement thing where it's like here's a bunch of stuff that you can sell and then get a commission on no so that's a thing that they did they're like you should try this oh really yeah and email they, or no it's like literally in tiktok so it's only certain what products. do they want you to sell well what there's was... a whole bunch of random shit and what i looked first options? first my thought was vr because i do vr and i do art so i was like what kind of vr shit do they have to sell and it's nothing then i was like what are the kind of art supplies they have is just like markers and most of it's like beauty, makeup, like kitchen supplies, that kind so of shit. So what commission you get? So if it's like a $20 product, you probably get like two fifty, three bucks from each one. Like it's a 10% commission pretty much. Do they have to buy it? Yeah, they have to buy it through your link, you know, on your video. So my thought was, I don't really want, I don't really think it's going to make me money, but I thought it might be funny to be like, here's my video and at the very end, just be like, if you buy the spatula, I get $2. Okay, bye. Spatulas. That's good. You know what I mean? Do something like that and just be like, here, I get this much if you buy this uh, this brush. Buy it. Buy brush. it. Brush. Yeah. But the, so how the, many spatulas have you sold? <laughs> I've not tried to spell any yet. I haven't, I haven't added Why any products. Why don't you try to do makeup and yeah. then put your makeup on and then sell it? No, oh, I have a very like rigorous thing I do on there and I don't... So you're not selling anything? You're not even going to try to sell anything? No, I'm probably going to put some stuff in there as as I think it's funny. And I I think it's interesting because then people watching get to see, people who don't have that offer get to see what kind of commission people are making on these things. Okay. I think that's kind of cool. 
But the whole thing with the TikTok getting banned bill, if you read it, ByteDance, the parent company of, Bit, of TikTok, is not mentioned anywhere in the bill. Neither Byte is TikTok. Dance? Yeah, ByteDance. The fuck is that? That's the parent company that owns TikTok. Okay, why do you... Who cares? Why? What's the significance of them? They're saying that the because it's a Chinese company, the Communist Party of China has the ability to just infiltrate it and get all their information. They can go to ByteDance and say, give me all of the TikTok people in America stuff. And they can't say no. So... The problem with the bill, though, is that it's not just about it's not just about TikTok. It's literally if you read the bill, it's giving our secretary of commerce, the United States secretary of commerce, the ability to basically wage cyber war and say we can shut down the American Internet in any country we want and we can shut out any country's Internet that we want for any reason without Congress and without the voters. That's why they want to ban it. That's why they want to pass this act called the Restrict Act, and they also they're using the Chinese scare of TikTok in order to get public, you know, support for this bill that takes away your public ability to enact your. But opinion. doesn't the United States government have our information anyway? Yeah, totally. So then, why can't Chinese people have it? Yeah, right. I, I said I'm not afraid of Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh's Chinese? No, they um, <laughs> Winnie the Pooh is banned in China because of his resemblance to Xi Jinping. The leader oh. of China. Uh, they don't allow Winnie the Pooh in there. Did so. you see the new horror movie with Winnie the Pooh? You know why that happened? It's because of the, oh, Winnie the, the Pooh. limitation of right. The yeah. rights was like a hundred years. I think it has to be a hundred years. Yeah, after a hundred years, you don't, you can't really like own Winnie the Pooh because it's been around for a hundred years. Like the um, like Beethoven. Yeah. Yeah, you don't have to copyright it and shit. Right. So they can't copy. You can't really claim ownership. So now there's all this like horror movie so about could, Winnie so the Pooh. So I can use Winnie the Pooh. Yeah, and in a hundred years, somebody can use Crackhead Barney and Friends. Oh shit! <laughs> and believe me, it's going to be reused and recloned, and the DNA I know, is going to be Barney. taken oh, from you. Oh my god! Hundred years, how is Crackhead Barney going to look like? Oh my god! There's going to be tons of Crackhead Barneys running around. Yeah. I know he may be Chinese. But it's Chinese 100, crackhead Barney. It's 100 Chinese. years after you yeah. die. So if you live forever on your moon colony, then you can always retain your rights. I'll be screaming yeah, from the moon. It's just going to be me and her. There's going to be no child. It's just going to be me and her, Jew and a black person. Yeah, doing a black animal. Look at us. We're like a math book. <laughs> You remember math books? Well, it looks like you're going to have to come with us. You're yeah. Gonna the, you're going to be part of this uh, experiment. I'll probably you know, be dying the, on the Mars mine at the Elon Musk spe- Teflon space. Oh, yeah. Space he's going to build another planet, soda. right? Mm-hmm. I'll be, in, I'll be in Mars, like, dying in the Coca-Cola I thought he mines. wanted to buy a bunch of land in Texas and, like, fucking build his own biodome. He did with that. With Pauly Shore. He moved to Texas. And Stephen Baldwin. Yeah. They, they moved movie. Down. I'm from Texas. Really? Yeah, but What's no one thinks accent? so. I grew up in California. So you're not from Texas. I was born there and it's good enough for Texans. I'll tell you that. Cause I was, a, you know, I go back to Texas and people are like, you California faggot. You sound, you know, fucking mm. blah, blah. and they'll be like, I was born in Austin. They go, Oh, good boy. So Austin is where? Is it like open? Oh, is- uh, Austin's the, in the center kind of. And it's like known for being the, um, a lot of people in Austin don't have accents because it's where the university is. Okay. So they're normal. Yeah. It's called the great people's Republic of Austin is a nickname for it. How about Houston? Houston's crazy. Kinda, a lot of a lot of shit comes out of Houston. It's pretty crazy. I know Texas is crazy. I want to I want to um film there. I want to see what happens. Yeah, I think they'll love you in Texas. You think so? Sure. I want to go to the the Sun downtown. Mmm. I I we drove, need to get you a security detail. Okay. We, yeah. <laughs> I went. Through, we'll come uh, with you in a van in the back. But when I was in Tennessee, I walked into a place, and the first thing I heard someone say was like, "You ever see what a rabbit looks like without its skins?" Thank <laughs> you.